What's up, y'all? This is Jeff Flexi Jr. from HabariTV.net and Ball Sports. <clears throat> and first of all, I'd like to send my condolences to all those affected by the Lafayette shooting in the movie theater. Um, they've now pronounced that three are dead, seven are injured, roughly seven are injured, some still in critical condition. And, I mean, this goes back to the topic of gun control. I mean, I live in the state of Kentucky where gun control... You know, they're. I mean, it's a very, it's a very conservative state, and they're very adamant about not having anything affect their, the rights to own a, you know, to bear arms. But, I mean, when you see people like this 58 year old man, 59 year old man, and and he ha he's, you know, he's diagnosed with mental illness. He has, you know, disruptive orders sent out against him by his ex wife. And they're still able to legally own a gun. I, I just, I find a problem with that. And so they're able to go into these movie theaters and shoot these innocent people. And, and these people who have families just like you and I. And they don't get to go home and see their families. I mean, that disturbs me. Yes, it does. Now, of course, people are, will still be able to get guns illegally. No matter, I mean, people will find a way to own guns, right? Like, we know this. But when the, when situations like this happen, it really bothers me. I mean, I mean, it bothers me so much that I almost get sick. I mean, I was watching this story. I watched it as it happened last night, and I was so disturbed last night. I couldn't even I couldn't even post a video last night. I, I had to wait till today, till later today, to you know get my thoughts under control, get my simmer down, and to be able to post this video. But with these tragedies. It, like the ones in Lafayette and the one in the movie theater and Aurora and Sandy Hook and I, I just wonder like what will it take why does this happen so much in America like this happens in America way more than any other country in the entire world like I think it's, this happens I mean if, if I'm fact you can fact check me on this but this happens more in America than like the next five largest countries in the world combined. I mean, something like this, well, mass, in, mass shootings by our own people, terrorist attacks by our own people. I mean, and it's and it's so sad. It's saddening that an, another person would want to harm, do harm to other people for no reason. People they don't even know for no reason. And once again, i like to send my condolences out to those. And, I mean, in Lafayette, Louisiana right now, you know, stay safe. God bless. Once again, my name is Jeff Lexi Jr. from AbariTV.net. And, and I just hope that we as a country will be able to grow from this. I mean, continue to grow from these situations because this right here, this it, it's not a good look. It doesn't make us look good to the rest of the world. It doesn't make us look good to our own people. And I've done videos before about how America, I mean, can America help protect black people and I'm I'm very staunch on that issue because I feel that I mean America and the president and the government could do more to help you know the the race of African Americans here in America, but when this happens to our own people, it, it makes me sit back and think, man, can America protect any of us? Like if this is able to happen, and of course crime is going to happen, but it's hard for me to just sit and and see these things happen to these innocent people and not sit back and be saddened by it. Once again, my name is Jeff Lighty Jr. Thanks for watching. Peace.